Hey, what's up, everybody? This is the Guest of Lee Stamus from GearWorks.com and the E2KG Network Podcast and channel on YouTube and the Rounding Off Trinity Gaming channel on YouTube. Back with another episode of the Diversion Legends. This is the sub-series on Rounding Off Infinity of Let's Plays and live streams featuring me playing sports games. We're going to be getting things a little bit sweaty tonight in some MLB The Show 19. Uh, my game save, embarrassingly enough, has not been touched since March of 2019, but uh, I have started a new job. I've tried to settle into a new schedule. I've been tweaking and moving and shoving things around with regards to uh, what games I'm going to play and content and the live streams and uh, it's been a couple months of struggle. Some of it I did to myself. I'm trying to get the camera spots uh, centered up here but uh, I think I've got my head wrapped around it now. So uh, here we are and here we go. 
So before we get things started proper, can I get uh, confirmation and verification that I've got good voiceover commentary coming out in the live stream? Can I get verification that I've got good voiceover commentary coming out in the live stream? Can we get confirmation that we got good voiceover commentary coming out in the live stream? All right, well, it looks like we might be 5x5 five five on audio, so let's get rolling here with my Kansas City Royals. I'm not quite certain exactly where I am in the season, so we're going to advance the day here. Ooh, let's make sure I'm, uh, where's my... So one of the things we're going to have to do, unfortunately, unfortunately, options, we're going to have to heal. Yeah, unfortunately, uh, I gotta get rid of the music uh, because when uh, I move this to YouTube, they will take it down. Uh, we'll try and okay. So final. So last game was me winning over Seattle, three to ten. Uh, where is the? That's what I need. I need the calendar. Okay. Cleveland was seven and nine. We're six and nine. Sim through the date. Wait, no. Yes, I do want to exit. I guess we'll just do day by day advancement because I don't know. That was a little funky. So the 13th. Okay. View organizations games. Yeah. So options. So one of the things I want to do is game controls, user settings. I'm 
trying to figure out where I can set this thing down and reduce fielding, pitching, batting, and base running. Mood specific options. I would have thought it would have been in mode specific, but I'm trying to Blad nab it. I'm trying to reduce the total number of innings that I play. Because I have been playing the uh, an entire nine innings of a game. Settings file associations. Alright. I can't see flip. So let's see if it's uh, data utility game controls. Maybe it's a slider. Nope. Frog. Let's see if we can change play full game. Oh, here we go. Okay. So, but how can you change that? Let's see where it's giving me. There's got to be an option to only play like five innings or something. I don't want to change. Like, I don't want to change how the game is played. I don't want to just manage. I don't want to lock on a player. aggravating. Minor leagues. Can we play at Bay Bayfront Bay Front Park? I think so. I think I'm good. Uh, I'll just let it auto decide.
MLB The Show's coverage of Major League Baseball is on the air. Today, a spring training matchup between the Cleveland Indians and the Kansas City Royals. Now a moment and here now, for the Indians' your, starting lineup. Mark DeRosa, what's your take on him this afternoon Kansas on the road? Matt, you focus on this lineup, the middle of the order jumps out at you because of the big power. But my focus today is on the table setters, the guys that set the tone. They have to be willing to work the count and find ways to get on base and create a little bit of havoc on the defense. Jake Junis is ready to go as he'll be on the mound for right. Kansas City. So we are yeah, almost a full year rusty. Got. Jake's got a big arm. Good we'll sinking fastball goes. too. Mid to upper 90s fastball. His breaking stuff has gotten a lot better. All he's lacking is experience. And if he's throwing strikes early on, he could be awfully tough on anybody. Hey guys, take a look at how Kansas City rusty sets game, up on the rusty day. stream. And let's take a look at Alex Gordon. We're going to change something to Originally make it in the stream. Uh, this season out of the is. University of Nebraska. I kind of had it had dealing to with outfield. audio issues from time there, to time. But now he's a multiple gold glove so, winner with unbelievable range and a strong just had, arm. I had a go XLR uh, already. Tyler Naquin. He will I just had a go XLR mini today delivered today, and I'm just at the point now where I'm just not going to bother streaming without the go XLR mixers. Uh, First pitch coming, here it is. And Ooh. we'll hold off on the slider Just here to start outside. the bat. It's ball one. First pitch, 106. We're just inside, I should say. I'm going to come back at him. With that high inside slider, though. The 1 0 home is off. Oh, that got the him. First strike. The temperature here at first pitch, a very seasonal 63 degrees this afternoon. All right, we'll go ahead and with the sinker this time. The one one is swung on and missed. Got him again. Number two. Let's go, Royals! Really, he wants me to come back at him with the sinker. Send him the slider again. Give him this one low and inside. Oh! Did he go around? The chase there. Come on! Down to third and no swing. It's ball two. Come on, Royals. Let's do this. All right, fine. We'll give him the change up. A high one here. Oh. Two to the Indian center fielder. Couldn't hold on to it. There's Carlos Gonzalez. He waits on deck. Go back to Cleveland. Yep. Give him the fastball. Now the three and two pitch. Is oh, caught him looking. Just flat out froze him there. Nothing too deceptive that about that four seam fastball. So I think he wasn't expecting Carlos it at all. Gonzalez. Whew. Yeah, we'll give him the fastball. Put a little outside. Here's cargo, Carlos Gonzalez. As he'll take Whoa. a look at a strike on the outside corner, it's 0-1. One out, nobody on. 
Nope, we're going to give him another fastball up high this time. And oh! Plane as yes he did. It's ruled a strike. Give him the slider this time. Looking for back-to-back -back K's to start the game. Oh, forget about this one. No, 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 no. And that ball will stay fair, and it's gone on a home run. <sighs> a solo shot here for Carlos Gonzalez as the Tribe move out in front one to nothing. Gave him the layup, and he ate it. Well, how do you beat the shift? You hit it over the shift, of course. You can't play guys up at the... Okay, so I can't deal with uh with not having any music <laughs> on this thing. Um, I have to hope that, uh, nobody flexes on this video when it gets posted to YouTube. I understand it's all in the fun, fun of playing some MLB. Batting third, the third baseman, Jose Ramirez. Uh, let's go with this guy with the curveball. Into the box, Jose Ramirez. Ball one. And that misses ball one. What? Lifetime one, against one. this particular That was inside the box! Oh! Up. For 13. Ugh. Bases are empty, one man out. Junis, Couldn't fight that one off. Curious case as a starter. Usually doesn't walk many guys, but at times he ends up giving up his share of hits. The translation on that is that he throws a lot of strikes, but oftentimes they are hittable strikes. One of the keys, Matt, you'll have to watch from this guy. A at times he kind of tiptoes, he tap dances around the strike zone. He has good stuff, but when he falls behind an account, he tends to nibble. Uh, and then when he brings the ball into the strike zone, and when he does, he becomes much more predictable. Right. And what happens with that? The hits per nine innings. And one problem is I don't remember how to field at all. Digging in, Francisco Lindor, as the switch Francisco. hitter will take his cuts left-handed here. Well, this isn't his more accomplished side. As a sinker. general rule, he's a much better hitter from the right side, but they're looking for him to come through here, swinging the bat left-handed. Swing and a screamer, <laughs> but this one's not going to stay fair. Two out, nobody on. Put this high straight down the middle. Yeah. In there, and Got he's got 0-2 <laughs> now. So let's take a peek at the umpiring crew in this one. Behind the plate is Ricky Holiday. Yeah, Dan, we got Ricky Holiday behind the dish tonight. I can't figure his zone out. He doesn't favor the hitter or the pitcher and can be a little too inconsistent. Send him the slider. Zero, you hit the nail right on the head. I think one of the things we're looking for, we're looking for a consistent zone. If it's a tight zone, it's a high zone. Have the same zone. His zone fluctuates a little bit Looper. too much. Get it back. Liking during the course of a get game. Get it, get it, get Perez, it. Perez shading to his right. Toot, toot. And that ends the inning. Indians That's run a wrap. first thanks to this solo home run. Bottom of the first coming up. It's now one nothing Cleveland. And with that, here's a look at the hometown Royals starting lineup card. Mark, what's your take on him against one of the best starters in the game? Yeah, Maddie, a lot of professional at bats up and down this lineup. I know they're behind right now, but it only takes one guy to set the tone and get the boys going. Trevor Bauer, a California-born right-hander, is on the mound. What's your take on him, Dan? 
pride and joy of the UCLA Bruins. Former number one draft pick with the Arizona Diamondbacks. This guy has really found himself good fastball. And he's one of these guys that he's into the new metrics. He likes to see that spin rate. That so I, what I'll probably do fastball. is I'll just manually good fastball, call the game. To 97. His curveball, though, fifth inning. might be his out pitch. It's a 12 My to turn is going to have the game curveball. simulate to the, the end at that point, or is right it going to just Time let me end the, the game Cleveland in the fifth Indians inning? Defensive setup today. And let's take a look at first baseman Carlos Santana. Originally came up from the minors as a catcher. Also has dabbled at DH, but don't get it twisted. This guy can handle first base as well with soft hands and big time power at the plate. Stepping, Stepping into the box, Adelberto, Adelberto Mondesi. He'll lead things Mondesi. off here in the bottom. I don't half remember of the how to bat. <laughs> first pitch on its way. Here we go. And that's cut on and missed 0 and 1. Good thing this is preseason spring training. Pitch types. Let's. Oh. Yeah, let's. Expect to be the, the knuckleball again. Right side, but it's well fouled. Ah. Fastball swung ah. on and missed for the first out. Boy, that's really disappointing for a guy that has wheels, right? Second. All he wants to Those do is get on base and take advantage where? of the strength of his game, oh, which where? is his speed. But with a strikeout right there, you can't get on first base if you strike out. Here's Chris Owings now. So go after ah. the first pitch and bounce it into foul territory. Behind it. Bauer. A six foot one inch right hander. He was a first round pick back in 2011. Yeah, Matt, you cannot miss on your first rounder, and they didn't with this guy. He has turned himself into an absolute Looks superstar. Like a slider. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. Here's a fastball oh, now that's hit dang. softly down the line to third. And there's out number two. Third. So and my batting leaves much Royals to be desired. Field, looking to get on base and keep this first inning alive. First offering on its right, way. We're going to guess inside. To third. Jeez, that third baseman is just swallowing everything Early coming out there. Time and the side is retired. Oof. KC down in order. They still trail 1-0. Striding in for the Indians, Leading Carlos the Santana team. will step in the to lead team. it off for Cleveland. Carlos. He'll be followed in the order by Jason Kipnis. This guy with the sinker. Low and a bit away. Infield in the overshift here. Now the pitch. Not surprisingly here. This is Go. on the ground to the right side. Pro to first right. will be in time. And there's one gone here to start the second. I think I maybe remember a little bit how to field. Hopefully now I just don't get uh, Jason Kipnis. His career numbers throwing a really compa complex play. <laughs> I'll be finger fumbling all night. Come on, Royal. All right, we're going to hit him with the change up. I'm going to put it up high. Come on, Royal. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Foul. Oh. Catcher's glove at strike one. Tied him up in that strike on a changeup, not a particularly good one. That changeup up in the zone like this oftentimes gets hit very hard. Was able to get away with it that time, but if he's going to be successful, he's going to need to get that changeup down in the zone around the knees. Oh, oh got him with the sinker. In the hole now, Owen two. Kipnis. Why don't you look Kip this third one short. in? He's a nine-year major league vet. Send him the curveball.
Let's try and the wind up and the start it outside. And the ah! That's a curveball on 0 and 2, but he holds back. It's 1 and 2 now. Tried to get him to chase that 0 2 curveball there, but he wasn't biting. Very well could see it again here, though. Oh, let's set him the slider. I'm not gonna try and put as much the English one, on two. it there. Go, 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 go. Walk and it down. Quick outs here in the second. Batting seven. Next the for the Indians hitter. is the designated Brad. hitter, Brad Miller. He'll work on keeping this top of the second alive. Start him with the slider. First pitch of the at bat. Go! Oh. Late swing there at the breaking Spaghetti. ball. Spaghetti! Been looking for something else. I agree. We'll send him the sinker. On its way, the 0-1 pitch. Whip. A shot oh. to first base and caught there to end the inning. Nada. Down in order go the tribe. We played an inning and a half. It's one to nothing. Here's the catcher, Salvador Perez. Leading He's set to lead off the home half of the, the second. Catcher, Salvador Perez. First pitch coming. Here it is. Oh! In the air right center. Oh. Ah. on his horse. Ah. He tracks it down. Nice play for the first out. Batting fifth. The left left guessed field. right that he was going to put that one down in the dirt. Against Trevor Bauer. Oh, He's told me four hits in 25 tries. He's taken him deep once. Infield shifted well to the right. Here's the first pitch. Ah. Swing and a miss. 0-1. One out, nobody on. And a good looking what? swing there from Gordon, but he can't come up with it, and it's 0-2 now. Every time you go out there to start a game on the mound, you hope to settle in quickly and get into a groove, and he's definitely done that so far in the early going. Looks like he could go pretty deep into this one. Here we go. Pulled high in the uh. air in the right field. Gonzalez has a read on it. He's got it, and there are two down now. Oh, come on. <laughs> and that'll bring up Jorge right Bonifacio. Here. He'll try Jorge. to make something happen with two gone in the bottom of the second. Here comes the first pitch. Here we go. Swung ah, and missed its that own knuckleball one. is screwing me up. He sends it out to left field. Oh, uh, the looper! Gone. Oh! Ho, 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 ho. Guess low and inside, and that's right where he sent it. A solo shot here to left. Man, with it, the Royals are back to even at one apiece. Nice! Yeah, let's see that replay. It's bad. I didn't think it Ooh. had the height to even clear the fence. Shows you how much I know that. Man, was that a thing was a laser. Kept going and going and going. Wow, that was impressive. That and that brings in pitch. Hunter Dozier. Oh, pitch to him is swung out of ball again. Strike one. Bases are empty here with two men out. Yes, uh, change up. Mm. Ah, I should have chased that one. With two strikes, and that will retire the side. Get out of the inning with the homer. But the Royals are able to knot things up on the solo home run. We play we'll take two, it. all even at one apiece. 
stepping up to the plate, Leonis Martin. Lifetime versus this pitcher. He comes in hitting right at a 300 clip. Agreed on the fastball. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Fouled away. Come at him with the curveball this time. The wind up and the 0 1. Oh, and the got him. In the hole, 0 and 2. Hey, sped him up, slowed him down, got him down 0 2. I think he could pretty much go anywhere right here. I'd be surprised if anything misses over the heart of the plate. Nope, we'll give him the change up this time. Crack, a fine running play there for the first out. Yeah, maybe he was going foul. Maybe he just gave up because he going foul. And I'm like, what? <laughs> All right, we'll send the change up again. It's just not been working that well for me. Trying to low and outside. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Ooh. Off the plate and away there. One ball. Held on to that too long. Give him the change up again. Comes in with the change up and it's 2 0. Oh. This at bat sets up really good right here, right? Hasn't seen a fastball yet, but now he gets to count at two balls and no strikes. He has to be looking for a fastball right here. From the windup, the 2 0 pitch. And this will be fouled away. Slider. Oh. And he missed again, high and away this time. Three and one. Jeez. It'd be great right here if he was able to work himself on base. You got the leadoff hitter on deck, and you know the middle of the order is coming up right behind him. Drives it out to deep. Go, 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 go. Sprinting after it. He gets there and makes a fine running play for the second out. Now batting, the center fielder. Need to pay now their outfielder, boy. Chance. By Marolex. Naquin, he looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Yeah, in today's game, certainly don't get completely reprimanded for too many strikeouts, but no one likes to go down looking. Expect him to be a little bit more aggressive at the dish this A.B. Nope. Here's a sinker to what? start him out, but he wouldn't bite. It's ball one. Ump is very stingy. On. Swing and a miss, one and one. He's looking really great on the bump right now. I mean, it's been a while yeah, since but that, he's allowed he's a got base very runner, little directional he's control. I'm pretty much. Another hitter right there. Now a ball lined to the left side. But foul. Really having to throw within a very limited envelope with this pitcher. Send him the slider. Ready on one and two. Ran one in on him there as this is his ah! third. That gets down and the inning. No, will no, no. What the heck? And he'll make it to second base now with two gone. Jeez. Man, that swing looked like self-defense than a real quality swing, but hey, right he muscled it out there and it was Carlos. enough to get him safely to Good second. Dollar. Those are the kind of hits that will drive you nuts as a pitcher. Bump was straight up in my way. Start him with the fastball. Come on, KC. 
Standing in now, Carlos Gonzalez. Oof. As he looks at a fastball that's that in the there for strike one. He launched one over the wall back in the opening frame. Send him that one again. I right, give him the same look. Ready with the 0 and 1. Swung on and hit in the air to left. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. And Gordon will make the catch to retire the side. Get out of the inning without giving up another run. Very close, though, very close. And spring training baseball after this. Late now is the designated go, hitter, Ryan O'Hearn. He'll start the things out here hitter. in a tie ball game. First delivery to him on the way. Lifted the other Got all of that. Center. Dropping. Nice. Get there as it falls in. Well, that's something you see often in batting practice. Guys using the whole batting field up. there, d -Row. I the like to see that a lefty that's just Luke not Ed. always pull happy. 100%, Dan. That pitchers have gotten so Man, much I really, in today's game that if you're not willing to play with the entire Like I said, field, with starting this new job, I really struggled with getting back. Here's Lucas Duda now. Popped him up. Ah! Uh, is there. <laughs> and that's the first down of the yeah. inning. Screaming at him from the stands, trying to make him mess up. So a runner at first with one man gone. Uh, and striding toward the plate next will be Adalberto Mondesi. I don't know why. I'm going to guess the cutter. I haven't Ready seen it. The first pitch. Here it comes. Oh, what the? Right. Ah, come on. As he puts this one away, two down. The center fielder, number two. Jeez. Red. Away. So it's a runner at first with two gone. And next to bat, it'll be Chris Owings. I guess cutter again. He's set and the pitch. This is sky ah. down left center. Lindor is there, and it's a very quick inning as the side is retired. So no runs on a hit here, no errors. One man. So, but yeah, we're starting this new job. I just I've been struggling to four. get back into gaming. Like every night I've come home, I've been tired. Again, Certainly have been wondering. He flew out in his last at bat. The third baseman, Jose Ramirez. Come on, let's get the out here. First delivery to him on the way. Line to the right side, but that's a foul okay. ball. Certainly have been struggling to figure out, like, why, you know, why I would skip sleep. Getting out here. Go back to Cleveland. The 0 1 pitch. <laughs> Set up ah. the change up, but it's 1 and 1. There's even been nights that I've. Like stayed up. The one one. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Gordon. So is like there. I didn't get any Makes extra sleep or anything. Away. I just sat here like contemplating the meaning of life and <laughs> like now that is. So next trying to find the, for the tribe. Francisco good spot uh, live stream and or, you know a live stream have been just got to the point where I was yeah, even Matt, like got to make an adjustment right here his swing definitely broke down struggling to even game and during the week the and I was like ah, I, just, I think I'm just gonna wait until the weekend all right guys let's do it. come on first pitch on his been way. teed up to 
popped up. <laughs> Dozier in foul ground. And this will not be caught. It's a foul ball. To start uh, He's this been doing a nice season of live streaming off. The deeper you get into the game, the more the hitters have seen you. This is the part of the lineup that he has to be really careful with. With MLB the show. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly so behind part of the one two. Part of the delay getting started with it was like I haven't played in so long, and here it comes. And I was trying to two. figure out, well, maybe I should. And he fouls this one off. Both teams with just two hits apiece thus far. Do like some warm up games before I tried live streaming it. Count remains at 0 and 2. Hey, I'm biased to the hitter right now. Keep frustrating that pitcher. Foul 12 of these things off. He's going to miss over the heart of the plate at some point. The 0 2 once more. Stays alive. Jeez. Still 0 and 2. Hey, I'm loving this right now. Classic battle. Five foul balls in a row. I'm going to have to start giving him the. Next one put in play for sake of pace of putting play. some more English on this. The fact that he's battling. And there we go. And missed. He's down on Sit down. Two are retired here to Cerebral begin assassin. Now batting. The first baseman. So two gone now for the tribe here in the fourth, and that'll bring in one of the best on base percentage. All of which has just made me forget like Santana. how fun this game is. Come here comes the first pitch. Weak grounder down the line at third. Uh, this is foul for the first strike. He's ready. Here's the 0-1. Oh. This ball will be chopped foul. One run, two hits. No errors to this point for the Indians. Give him the sinker. He's getting engaged in some tough battles here. Don't need it. Here comes another 0 2. Ah, come on. Just a bit low. Don't be shocked if he doesn't go right back to that same pitch. You could tell he jelly legged him at the plate a little bit, froze him, but just missed his own. Curveball. Off. So I'm going to have to start putting this out on the edges. Come on, Royals. Again, a one two. Get that. Ah! Center field, line drive, base hit. Whoa, that ball was closed, whizzed right by his head. I think he probably the heard it go by, guys. That's Second pretty base. unsettling for a pitcher. Jason. Trust me, oh. I know. Gipnet. Whoa! Really? At least the center fielder got it and didn't miss it like that uh, left outfielder did. Left fielder. And is the second baseman, Jason Kipnis. He swings and lines it to left. And that's in there. Base hit. Heck. Hey, after back-to-back -back two out hits right now, this pitcher thought he was going to cruise through this inning. And now he's got traffic. Brad. And he's in jeopardy with a ball in the gap or a ball missed over the heart of the plate. A crooked number going on the board. Hey, we're going to give him the sinker. 
Stepping in now, Brad Miller. As he takes a cold strike at the knees, it's 0-1. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. And I forget what I need to do. We'll do the curveball. Ah, uh, come on! Dirt here. Throw over to third here, and he's going to make it up to yeah. third here as he advances on the wild pitch. Great. Well, you live by the sword, you die by it, too. He went with an off-speed pitch down in the zone, and that's the risk you take there. The catcher can't come up with it, and two runners advance. Now they're both in the scoring position. Sinker. Try and put this in this lower left-hand zone here. It's really shaky on his accuracy down there, though. The 1-1. One, one. Nope. No offer Oof. on that one. Two Come balls and a strike. A lot of times you see guys get too aggressive and try to do too much at the plate with guys on. But Change right up. here, he's doing a great job of waiting on the right pitch. Got himself ahead in the count now. Let's go. Come on, let's roll. The set and the 2-1. and one. Got him. A big swing and a miss here. Two strikes. Definitely a big pitch coming up right here. He's going to be pumped if he can work his way out of this inning with the game still tied. Let's hold him, guys. Let's hold them. Curveball. Ground ball sent back. Ah! And that's through into center field. Base hit. And both runners will score as they've Great. taken the lead here at 3-1. to one. <sighs> Hey, even though we're in the, the middle of this one here, the D that's a big base hit and two RBIs to Mark. boot. Yeah, you never know. Yeah, I tried to get the second baseman to dive, and I hit the. Uh, like I said, I've just forgotten how to field, to so. Through for the team. Great at bat right there. Hit the wrong button, and it wound up switching to the outfielder, to the center fielder. Here's Leonis Martin. As the first pitch here's a bit high, it's ball one. He's 0 for 1 thus far. This pitcher is not holding it together. Here's a changeup that's right there, one and one. Got to kind of stop pushing him to throw so many things. Uh, out on the edges. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One, one. A ball and two strikes now. Let him get some pitches down in his comfort areas. Come on, Casey. Hit on the ground out to short. Mundesee picks it up. A play at the plate. And after that head scratcher, everybody's going to be safe. Yeah, I was, I was still thinking that the... There's from the last down in the zone. Uh, pitch, thrown to first. With two strikes, not the kind of pitch you're looking for. 0-1 or 0-2. When Sometimes I had to field, I was like, ah, oh, wait, is somebody on third? To all the work he's been putting in underneath in the tunnel, staying through the baseball. On, Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Sinker on the inside, and that's a strike. It's a rough first game back. Should have figured that it would be. Here comes the 0-1. This is foul right side. Miller at second. Martin at first. Two out in the inning. Change up again. Oh! So it's two runs on four base hits. No errors and a couple of men left on. To the bottom of inning number four we go. It's the Indians three and the Royals one.
Nick Merrifield next to hit. Go for Blue one for him here in this one. Hey, we're still in the early stages in this one. They're only down by a couple Merrifield. of runs. But it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. The bouncer to the left side. Oh. Throws ah. in time, and that's out number one. In now, Salvador Perez. So far, <laughs> go for one with a fly out. Perez. Here comes See if we can get a touch pitch. hit here. Now a swing, and he just fouls this one away. Ah. Salvador ah. Perez behind in the count, nothing in two. These are huge innings for a team's morale. The pitcher wants to go out and throw that shutdown inning up and get the boys back swinging the bats again with a chance to capitalize and even extend this current lead. Into the windup, here comes the 0-2 pitch. Swing. Ah, like knuckle ball. There, and that's out number two. I cannot do anything so with he's that. He's really locked in at this point in the game on the bump. The so far this inning, four pitches and two Allen. outs. Got the first guy on Gordon. one pitch, and then absolutely dominates this at bat with a three-pitch strikeout. So bases are empty here with two gone, and that'll bring up the veteran left-handed hitting outfielder, Alex Gordon. Pulled toward right center field. Nick one's under it, and the inning <sighs> is over. Royals go down one, two, three. Score holds. It's three to one. Going into the fifth. So striding forward now, Tyler Naquin. He's working on a one for game. two game so the far. Yep, top of the fifth. Tyler Naquin. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Oh, oh man! Taken for a strike. Paints the side of the box with that. The wind up and the 0 1. Behind 0 2 now. Come at it with the slider. Here it comes 0 2. Oh, that hits the English on it. Right center. Merrifield calls for it. He's got it one away. The way he showed some pretty Ball was moving like in three different directions at once. To bring that one down. Thought the outfielder might call him off, but he clearly had it under control. Here we'll go curveball. In now, Carlos Gonzalez. Yes, he'll take a tough pitch on the nice. outside part of the plate for strike one. A hit in two tries for him so far. Trying to put a little uh, control on the ball after the pitch that seems to be working better with this pitcher. Swing and a ball hit out toward right there. Center. Owings has a read on it. And he makes the there catch for the second out. Now batting. Now batting. Jose, Jose Ramirez. Ramirez. 0 for 2 Ramirez. from him so far in this one. Apparently I mean, nobody likes Jose. In the rough Jose Ramirez has been for Terry Francona and the Cleveland Indians. This guy burst on the scene in 2016. Just absolutely set that lineup on fire. They were looking for a guy to bail out Michael Brantley and the production they would miss from him in the lineup, and Jose Ramirez filled that admirably. That's a, a ball and no strikes. What? Ball one, no strike. Ah, ump. Seriously, that dude was right. There was a strike. All right, we'll give him the change up. Oh, 
And 2 0 now as this misses below the knees. Well, here's a guy we know is swinging it pretty well. Like ran out of steam halfway to the plate. Based on those last two pitches, I think I know why. He's doing a great job of putting himself in counts where he's likely to be successful. Now the 2 0 home. Oh! With that one. 3 0. Yeah, I put too much. I'd be shocked if this wasn't a four pitch walk right here. He doesn't want to mess around and leave something over the A little too much on that too early. Situation. And what is that? that ran in and got him. What is that? And nobody on. That's the last thing you want to do on the mound. That really gives the opposition some hope that they can do something with this inning. So here's the cleanup hitter, Francisco Lindor. He was sat down on strikes in his last at bat. All right, I'm going to start warming the guy up. I wish I could tell what my skill level was with the guy. Oh, uh, yeah, Junis should show. Nope. All right, we'll get box burger ready. Where is his, uh, I think we just tell you his readiness in text. All right, fastball. He's set, here it comes. Runner goes, strike called, now uh. to throw down. And no throw, in fact, as he'll just hang on to it. Yeah, I couldn't remember how to. Froze me. I was trying to remember how to pick a guy off before the pitch. All right, fastball. The 0 1 pitch. Runner goes for third. Pitch is a cold strike. The throw is not close as he's in there with a stolen base. A pretty unusual decision to swipe third with two outs in the inning. It's a big risk, especially with the lefty hitter up there. And the benefit isn't all that great, but he made it work out. Not good. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the 0 2 pitch. Oh, and he hi. missed with it. It's 1 and 2. Go with the sinker. Man, this pitcher just has. It's not giving me anything. The 1 2. Hit in the air out to right. Bonifacio's get that, under get it. that. And that ends the inning. Whew. Indians leave it's out of it. As the lead remains three to one. Coming to the plate now, Jorge Bonifacio. And he's off to a hot start in this one. Homer his first time around. Things not looking very good so far in this one, but we're still in the middle innings. They're down by a couple of runs, and this is the right place and the right time to get Stinking something going. The last thing they want to do is to try to come from behind and win this one in the eighth or ninth inning. Nope. The Guessing wrong. Here and he's in control 0-2. Boy, good cutting ah. into that pitch as that's the first out of the inning. Oh, come on. That's not an at bat. He it? or his Third hitting coach base. are going to be happy Hunter. with at all. It's bad Hunter. enough to go down on three pitches, but none of them were even in the strike zone. That's a bad look. Shut up. 
<laughs> Let me have my bad batting. Into the box now, Hunter Dozier. Here we go. He'll swing and lift a ball foul <sighs> to the left and out of play. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. He's got a good batting average this season, though. A swing and a shot hit ah. down the And he just couldn't keep that ball fair as it winds up a long foul ball. Now here's the pitch. This is skied into short left center. Door has a play, makes the play, and there are two gone now. Now next will be the designated hitter, Ryan O'Hearn. He reached on a single in his first try. At Ten ribbies. Music's not helping. He's ready, here's the first offering. Oh, and just a miserable effort there. It's over. <sighs> I, just, I thought that was the fastball. <laughs> the offense right now. This guy's got a low pitch count. He's attacking the zone. They have to get more aggressive. This guy's not going anywhere. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 and 1. Fast. Sure. Oh. Trying to take control of the inside part Ooh, of the Let's put a pause on that there. Hey, how, guys, how you going? Loki Loco, do squirrels run across the field? Hey, guys, thanks so much. Uh, thanks so much for the follow, Verge DC. Very much appreciated. You guys are catching me on a very stinky night of baseball. I have not played in uh, the save file the last time I touched MLB 19. It was about March of last year. Popped him up. Ramirez, Ugh. room in foul territory, and that'll put an end to Great. the inning as he brings it down on the warning track. I'm definitely not good at batting, but uh, thanks so much for swinging through. I appreciate y'all. No, Loki. <laughs> Squirrels do not uh, run across the field. Although the way I bat, you would think that uh, I'm being distracted by some squirrel. How you guys doing tonight? Hope everybody's doing well. You guys, uh, you guys both have the three-day weekend? Carlos Santana. All right, let's see. Is uh, Boxberger ready to go? He is still listed as warming up. I think he's good, though. Let's go ahead and put him in. Jake Newberry. Will what? No, no, no. Block. Ah, uh, now I'm locked. <laughs> Number 68. I didn't realize I had, uh, I thought I had the guy who was already warming up selected. Great. No, just... Do I have to throw these warm-up pitches? Newberry is one of my actual starters, too, so I hope this does not, uh prevent me from getting him in the lineup. Well, thanks again, guys, for stopping by. Uh, Verge DC, or is that your name because you uh, live or work in Washington, DC? Boxberger had that gray stripe around his name. I thought that that was, uh, I thought I was selected him to come in. Nope. So I guess I have to pitch with the guy I mistakenly put in at least. Great. Awesome sauce. First delivery to him on the way. And he gets ahead 0-1. Well, Loki, thanks so much for stopping by. Long time no see. 
Thanks for swinging through on a Sunday night. Swing, high drive, deep down the left field line. This ball is slicing. He threw first and hustling for second. And now this will get over the Why did the outfielder the just give up? Well, he hit that one pretty well all the way out to the warning track. And clearly, there's some hard dirt out there because that ball bounced right over the wall for a ground rule double. Runner at second now. Nobody out. Ugh. And standing in now, the power hitting second baseman, Jason Kipnis. Hard lessons to learn here the first night back. See, can I bring Boxberger in now? Brad Boxberger will come on and get some work as he makes his second appearance so far this spring. That lady singing now. <laughs> Probably right. No, we don't need to do the warm up. Let's just go. All right, I agree. We'll start him off with the slider. First pitch of the at bat. Hangs Ooh. on him a bit that time as it's belted out toward deep center field. But not ah! off the center field wall. And he's in there safely. Great he's Scott, got man. Like, Gordon's throw comes in, and that'll hold the runner at third. Get everything that could possibly go yeah, wrong. It's got to be a base running mistake right. right there. But taking a look at it, I guess, in his defense, he had to wait to see if the ball was going to be caught. By the time he saw it get down, the ball was already on its way back to the infield. No, not really. All right, I'm gonna change up. I guess at this point, I'm just trying to survive to get out of this thing. Into the box, Brad Miller. As the first pitch to him is a changeup that can't find the zone. It's ball one. Boxberger, a previous member of the Diamondbacks organization. He signed as a free agent with this organization earlier in the season. Yeah, he didn't have an opportunity to really get That's acclimated second base to this ball off? club. Showing up during the season is not always easy, opening the doors to a big league clubhouse and trying to get to know your teammates. The best way to get to know them is to go out and produce. No. Pick okay. Off, move to second, and the runner will get back standing. Now a spin and another throw back to second, keeping particularly close tabs on him. What is up with him in the big lead? Dude! And now he'll go back to second another time here, being especially careful here. Dude is not respecting the pitcher at all. Shut him down now. The 1-0. Nice. The play off to the right. It's one and one. Go back at him with the change up. Ready to deal. Here's the one one down the third baseline. Ah, come on and with he that. Delivered one of the biggest at bats of the afternoon what? as he cashes in with a base hit. And they'll extend their lead even further as the runs in to score from third. And it's a four to one game. Like, I don't understand why he held on to it. I was holding down for him to throw to third. Gets him to hit it on the ground, but obviously the result wasn't what he wanted. <laughs> We're seeing fastball. Standing in now, Leonis Martin. Right, that was right where I put it. The first pitch fastball, 0 and 1. A hit in two at bats for him at this point in the ball game. 
All right, at this point, so let's see what happens. If I hit exit, yeah, see, I don't want to simulate an exit. That's fine, until I can figure out how to just play the game for five innings. Let's play ball. He's safe. He's out. Full four. Take your base. Out. Got it. Three. It's hard to win games at any point, but to win games on the road, especially I guess in this until like I guess I have to figure out how to with this win. set the game to just make the final total today. Game the five Cleveland innings. Indians took the lead in the fourth and <laughs> held on until the <laughs> end. <laughs> Trevor Bauer is the winning pitcher of record, so that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney. And I guess I'll just play the five innings Matt and then look to the end. Watching MLB the show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com. Not a good initial outing. The final line score for this afternoon's ball game for the victorious Cleveland. Nope. Just need to exit. All right, up next is Texas. Oof, they're 12 and 5. Stadium. Training action from the Cactus League between the Texas Rangers and the Kansas City Royals. Six and ten. A chance now and to now. look at the batting order Your for the visiting Rangers. Who's the one to watch, Dan? Kansas yeah, you have City to like the various Royal. skills that Sin Su Chu brings to the plate. He's certainly a guy to watch out there in this lineup. Everything he does makes them click. When he's swinging the bat well, they just go. So this is uh, actually might be the first live stream. It's definitely one of the first few live streams from uh, this PC since I recently upgraded it. 
Hey, thanks, Matt. Danny Duffy, you're looking at a small stick of dynamite. This uh, Not a PC real big was a transplant for my first pounds, but dedicated shooting box that I built. Sneaky quick, so that first build was back in good, hard spring of 2017. Slider. His changeup is getting better. You'll know if Danny Duffy And then the last year, I forklifted it out of the mini ITX case so that it was in. Put it in a micro ATX case. And let's take a look at Alex Gordon. And prepped for uh, putting a full length. Basement, being able to put a full-length video card in it. So it's got a gigabyte to move to the outfield, GeForce not move there, GTX 1070 WinForce 2 Overclock winner with GPU in it now. And a strong, accurate arm. Digging in but I just now, recently we went in and, uh, and we are ready for some daytime baseball. upgraded the CPU to an AMD Ryzen 7 3800X. All right, we'll start him with a two-seam fastball. Is he a left-hander? Now here's the pitch. Fastball on the first pitch, and it's taken for strike one. Now this off is a little more liberal. He's not as stingy on the edges like that last time. We'll was. see how much longer the umpires can wait. Well, you Fish. could say that again, five. Matt. It's raining cats and dogs out there. All right, Make slider. Sure step in a poodle. I think it's time to get the grounds crew out. A one pitch on its way. I right, tied him up two. again. Duffy, a California-born ball player, he was selected. Duffy, in the much more accurate. Back in the draft of 2007. Janice. Yeah, he has turned himself into a really nice ball player. I wouldn't put him on the superstar level, but you know what? They didn't miss with this pick either. You go into high rounds and you carve out a career the way this guy has. Nice pick. Oh, the change up oh he sits him down quick. Strike, and the leadoff man is gone to begin the ball game. Flat out locked him up with the change up right that there. Exactly. Usually you're trying for a Duffy, swing the miss professional. In a two strike count, but clearly he wasn't looking for it. So it's a backwards K for him. So next to the plate for Texas, Hunter Pence. He'll get to take his first cuts here. All right, we'll start him off with the fastball. Going away from the stretch. Hit high and deep. Go, 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 go. On the move. Go, go. There you go. Really had to hustle to get to that. No, he's gone now. Battle third. Up next for the Rangers, Elvis Andrews. First chance for him here in the top of the first with nobody on. All right, we'll give him the four seam. First pitch coming, here it is. Hey, in there, and it's 0-1. And there is our officiating crew in this one, calling balls and strikes, Mr. Freddie Ferguson. You know, this is one thing of the guys from the orbit Freddie and caught Ferguson the edge. Dan, that the rookies are going to have a tough time with. If you Four played in the league for a little bit, you understand that he's got his own zone. Uh, you touched on it, Dero. I think he rewards the veteran players, not only pitchers, but Dero. position players. Oof. He makes the younger players. He makes them earn their that lefty feet. is making you them go fish. The right there. You got a great hitter at the plate. It's early in the count, and he wanted to get ahead. Nice challenge pitch right there. Now here comes the changeup. Duffy sets, 0-2 on its way. Now he drops Woo! the changeup on him, straight three called, and a great pitch there. That was a three-course meal. Down in order. The Royals will get their chance now in a scoreless ball game. That was really an excellent setup. He hit him with those two fastballs right off the bat that came back with the changeup. Starting lineup card. High and on the edge outside. At home, what do we need to know about Text these book. guys? Well, Matty, the key to hitting the course field is the fact that there's so much outfield ground for those guys to have to cover. There's a lot of. Yeah, I don't know that I've live streamed from this box since I did that upgrade that gonna drive the ball out on the, of the CPU. Park. That's going to happen naturally with just a good approach and a good pass at the baseball. But there's a lot of ground to cover in that outfield, which screams there are a lot of hits. To in be fact, had. I think that back. This is definitely the first live stream because everything. All the hardware, software integration that I had to do to set up for this live stream was all the first time because I did an operating system fresh install with this upgrade because I had to bring in a new motherboard. 
but a premium defender at second base. And if you don't slide properly into second base, he is going to let you seem know about to it. be going okay so far. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. The shortstop, Adalberto Mondesi. Go searching up high. Here comes the first pitch. Ah! Close on that swing. No balls and a strike. Okay, I'm going to look for the curveball this time. Nope. Give him the fastball. Mondesi has what you'd call elite speed. His legs are a big part of his game on both sides of the scorecard. This is one tool, Matty, I know nothing about. We're looking I for the cutter this time. Base, hand my batting gloves to the first base coach. Give daps to the first base. Oh, like drops. This guy gets on first base. And nice, Mondesi. second and third. Hey, this game's starting off exactly the way Yeah, when your leadoff off man gets on base, in the bottom of the first after they good start. Went out there and Boop. threw a donut on the board, boys are flying around. Good contact hit. Solid. Stepping in, Billy Hamilton. He'll swing it from the left side right here. More of a comfortable side from the left side. Puts the ball in play, more of a contact hitter from the left side. Might have grown up being a natural left-handed hitter. He'll go looking for the cutter. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Just able it to get was the cutter, but uh, this is a tough spot here to turn two off this guy at the plate. One of the things you really have to make sure defensively to make sure you get at least one out. Don't try to turn that double play. If you get the sure out at second, take that. And if you get it at first, well, that's just an added bonus. But make sure you at least get one out in a spot like this. And a pitch out, nothing doing though, and that's ball one. Is he looking to try and get Mondi to bite on the steal? To try and get him off off the field. Now the one and one pitch. That's popped up. Uh, right there uh, the field, and he tracks it down. Nice play for the first down. I was hoping that was going to get out over his That's shoulder. exactly what they That's wanted out of that pitch up in the Wait. zone. They took him up the ladder, and he couldn't get up to it. So that was an easy pop out. Well executed pitch there. They're looking for the cutter. With Merrifield next to hit. And a pitch out, nothing doing though, and that's ball one. See if he comes back low and outside Mondesi this time. Stands at first with one out. Pop straight up. But this will land untouched. Really starting to pour now, and the forecast is not showing any signs outside. of a break in the weather. You know, one of the big issues is player safety. And right now, this field is getting sloppy, wet, Matt. And I don't know how much more rain this field can Very take. risky to decide to look that one in. Ah, out and missed, and it's even at two and six. <sighs> Swing and a miss on the Shit fastball. Shouldn't have gone fishing for that one. Number two. Well, that's just a quality pitch right there. The location was excellent four. because if it's put the in play, there's a good chance it's on the ground for a double play. And oh, hey, a strikeout right. always works too. Here's the catcher, Salvador Perez. And a pitch out, nothing doing though. And that's Why does he keep pitching one. him out like that?
the 1 0 home. A swing and a miss, strike one. <sighs> Prior history versus this arm. He's gone five for 13. Two of those hits were for home runs. Oh! And oh! KG! Slugster! Nice adjustment by the batter right there. Batting you cannot big. fault the pitcher no for going fielder. to that well again. Alex. First one, he swings and misses through. Jordan. And this one, the batter's able to execute and drive it for a base hit. Here's the left fielder, Alex Gordon. Go after the first pitch and bounce it into foul territory. One offering. My oh. alley in left center. Boop. And he won't get it as that's down for a base hit. And a good throw. Wow. Holding that runner at third, so the bases become loaded now with two gone. Loaded. Well, so nothing's guaranteed, but when you can load the bases in the home half of the first, you've got to find a way to at least cash in one. If this guy escapes this mess, his confidence is just going to grow as the game goes on. Yeah, no doubt. Standing in, Jorge Bonifacio. And a golden opportunity here to give his guys the lead with three men aboard. First offering on its way. Ah. And he waves at a curveball there. No balls and a strike. Come on, Jorge. Come set. The 0 1. Swing and a soft line. Oh! Throw on the second for the force, and the side is retired. Dang. Royals wind up leaving him alone. Still no score. Bad, bad, bad. As we begin the second inning in Denver, here's Heidi with an update on the weather conditions. Well, Matt, it doesn't appear that we're going to get much of a break from this rain at all as the game progresses. However, I am also hearing that this rain isn't supposed to intensify too much. The grounds crew will be on standby just in case the umpires do call a delay. But the goal is to get this one in uninterrupted. Yeah, Heidi, and thanks. Even with all the technology that we have today to be able to forecast the weather accurately, one never knows what Mother Nature has in store. All right, Greed will start him off the forcing fastball. Not really giving me much of anything to work He's with ready. here. Here's the first offering. Hey. Ooh. Fastball over the outside, but in there for a strike. Career numbers Duffy. against Danny Duffy. He's just one for six. Nope, we're going with the slider. Actually, we're going to go right back to that outside edge. Good hard slider there, but it runs away. It's a ball and a strike. A great take on that slider away right there. But I'm thinking in that situation, that pitcher's got to execute a little bit better. That was almost a non-competitive pitch. Being outside, you could almost have let that one go right out of his hand. Two and one. What? There's not too many umpires in the game that are going to ring that first strike right there. That was borderline up, even though it was in the zone. And I missed that. I think I think he called it a strike. Have to go back and watch the VOD. Now the two one. Oh! And it's fouled away. Yeah, so he, I think he called that a strike. Give him the curveball. Haven't really used that yet. Set and the 2 2 pitch. Come on, Here's man. A breaking ball that couldn't quite catch the inside. Waiting on deck is Drupal Cabrera. All right, we'll give him the change up. Bit inside. And oh, wow. For the first down. That tied him up in a knot. 
the third baseman. At the plate as Drupal Cabrera. Cabrera. Okay, we'll start him off with the curveball. Tough pitch here. Here's the pitch. Lifted in the air to straightaway center. Hamilton is under it, and he brings nice. it in for the second out of the inning. Batting fit. The, so the plate now for oh, Texas boy. is the DH. Shin Su Chu. He'll work on keeping this top of the second alive. Start him off with the curveball. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Yeah. And that misses for ball one. Way off. Change up. Now oh, it's come on, Duffy. What the heck? No score here as we play inning number two. Go with the change up again. Too nope, high, and it's three and zero. Oh. Nope, right. Now with the base is empty, I think he needs to be careful not to just groove one here just because it's three and zero. Oh. He's a guy that could ambush you and lose one over the wall. Now we're going to change up. Here it is, the three zero. -oh. There's ball four. Ah. Well, they were He's been throwing him too far to the right, so I tried I to pull it back to the left. The base is empty and too wide outside on the inside edge. Yeah. The plate makes somebody else beat you. Fortunately, no damage on that one. Career numbers against Danny Duffy. He has a three for twelve. We're gonna have to sit this guy down though to get out of the inning. Let's hit him with the changeup. I'm not sure, to be honest with you. What's up, man? Who's your favorite pitcher in baseball? Uh, I actually <laughs> don't watch a lot of baseball, so I couldn't tell you who my favorite pitcher is. Um, I pretty much just enjoy playing uh, MLB The Show. So I apologize. I am not a true baseball fan. I really just don't keep up with sports a lot because they take takes up so much time, and because I'm I'm obsessive about it. When I do watch a sport, I have to watch the whole, you know everything every day all the time, and uh, just wound up not being a good lifestyle for me. So first pitch coming here it is. Get hard back up the middle. Oh my gosh. There's a hard hit ground ball. Pitcher not able to get a glove on it. Hard single. So uh, what I have kept up, well, the most recent sport I would have kept up with would have been motorsports. Back when we had the Speed Channel, I could keep up with all the European circuit races. But uh, when the Speed Channel went away, it uh, became a little too difficult in the streaming age to try and keep up with motorsports. So I've just kind of fallen off on that as well. Got plenty of spaces, plenty of room to work this guy around the strike zone. In now, Ronald Guzman. As he'll there we go. Look at a high strike that time. It's nothing in one. Starting to bring it back. Who's all over the place. Now, who's your favorite pitcher in uh, baseball, dude? Here in inning number two. I'm not sure to be honest with you. Thanks so much for swinging through the live stream, by the way. I appreciate you swinging by. Let's go with the curveball. Put it up high again. The 0-1 offering. High and deep down the left field line. And Way this foul. Will up a foul ball. Go with the two seam fastball on this one. Yeah. Keep putting it up high. Fouled away. Chased it. Chu over at second. Odor on at first with two down. Let's see if we can break him with the slider. Low and a bit inside. A pause. And the 0 2. There we go. Everybody's on their feet. <laughs> we'll go to the bottom of the second. No score. Have me worried, Duff. Way to bring it back. 
And that brings in Hunter Dozier. I don't make lead off the home half of the second. I'll give some people some uncomfortable conversations to have with the manager when they get back to the dugout. Okay, let's look for the curveball. The first pitch to him. It oh! What's he? Right back to the mound, and he'll flip on to first. To Come on, down. man! That should have been an ankle biter. Now at the plate, Ryan O'Hearn, and he'll hitter. get his first opportunity in this one. First delivery to him on the way. Looked like he was Too far behind no it. matter what that time as he goes way out of the zone at that offering. It's 0-1. Look for the cutter. Is put in uh. the right side of the infield. Odor charging in on it. And there are, are you going to make that man now? run all that way? So bases are empty here with Luka. two gone. And that'll bring up the left-handed power threat, Lucas Duda. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. And he goes against the shift. Uh. This is on the ground with the left side. Throw on to Guzman at first, and the inning is over. Pretty painless half of the inning, all told. We'll go now to the top of the third, and we are tied nothing nothing. Now in the box, Jet Bandy. He'll stand in to open things up here in the third. Number 28, Jet Bandy. High bat. Okay, we'll go with the fastball and we'll try and put it outside here on the box. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Hey, and nice. Here's a fastball called for strike oh, one. one. Let's try the two seam fastball. Put this one low and inside, move them around the box a little bit. The 0 and 1 delivery. Oh! Fastball as he gets the swing and a miss. Hey, that's just a great pitch right there. Fastball at the bottom of the zone, right what? under the knee. It's interesting. I was a low ball hitter, so you could take the strike zone and go to the ground with it. I can live with that being called a strike. What I can't live with is above the belt getting popped. And he fouls this one off. Sitting him back with the curveball. The next 0 2. Hit fairly well out towards straightaway center. Hamilton is under it. One away. There we go. The Back to the top of the order now. And up to the bat line. next to Lino DeShields. Okay, we'll start him off with the slider. Put it up high. Around the numbers. Here comes the first pitch. Here's a slider to start things out. Looked at for ball one. Third yeah, that was outside no the box. This point. I couldn't argue with that. Send him back with the slider again. Whoa! Well, here's a guy we know is swinging it pretty well at the plate lately, and based on those last two pitches, I think I know why. He's doing a great job of putting himself in counts where he's likely to be successful. Now the 2-0. Grounder down the line. There we third. go. But oh, no. ball and it's two and one now. Take a bounce. Go with the curveball. And start this one outside. He's set and the two one pitch. And he can't get ah. the corner here, so he's behind three and one. On deck, there are the unique stylings of Hunter Pence. He'll be next. All right, so slider. A little bit low. The 3 1. Finds the zone. There we go. The count, three and two. Start Hunter off with a two seam fastball. Now the pitch. Popped up. Duda Easy out. And Ooh. he brings it in for the second out. Dang, that dude has a 95 speed. Now batting, 
So striding in, Hunter Pence Hunter. fly down in his first oh, half bat, so make him 0 for 1 so far. Two seam fastball here. A little bit outside. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Put that low and outside. Out of his hot zone. He comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. Ah, the dirt. Pulled the fastball down a little too much there. That's ball one. Bases Come back at him with the curveball. Keep trying that outside and low. There we go. Nicely done. I know you're standing on the mound. You got two quick outs right here. But you have to respect the fact that this lineup can hit you and hit you in a hurry. Oh, I do Number respect two it. Whole batter up at the plate. He has a chance to get on. I get know. The big boys up. I know. So, uh, keep putting the slow one outside. Duffy sets coming home with a one. -one oh, pitch. got him! Just behind the fastball there. Two I know he didn't think I was going to come back at him low again. He wasn't ready for the fastball. Yeah, and they set him up with that curveball on the pitch before, and that one they just blew right by him. And they All right, let's go put this one up around the numbers. Now, I suppose. The one-two. Still a Thanks. ball and two strikes. Come back with the fastball again. I'll put it low and outside. No nope. good pitch around the knees, but it doesn't quite catch the bottom of the zone. Yep, two seam fastball. I agree with that. I keep going at him low and outside. Slow roller down the third baseline, but a foul ball as it holds it two and two. He's fighting it off. Two seam fastball. Go low and inside this time. Another try at two two. Rounded down the third baseline. Backhanded. Oh, go it! And he'll have no play as he reaches first base safely. Oh, no, no, no. I got nervous. I was hitting third base instead of blasting. Here's Elvis Andrews now. First time up, he went down looking. Yeah, and they froze him on a good changeup. Tough one. If you got good arm action, and this pitcher certainly does have good arm action out there, tough to decipher right, we'll between the slider and change up. He's got to be willing to stay back and take the ball the other way. First offering on its way. Fly ball out toward left center field. Go, 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 field. go, 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 go. Hamilton. He tracks it down, and that will end it's the, out of the inning. inning. One left for Texas. Home half of the third coming up, no score. So it's back to the top of the order now. And striding toward the plate next will be Adalberto Mondesi. Adalberto Mondesi. First pitch on its way. Yep. And there's a big Put it right where I was looking for it. With that, the Royals have their leadoff on the board to start out the inning. Even though that pitcher was able to execute <laughs> in Number off the six. plate, batter was Billy. able to keep his hands inside that baseball Hamilton. and drive it up the middle. It happens every once in a while, you guess, <laughs> right where they put it. Here's Billy Hamilton standing in. He swings and grabs ah. the short. There's one to first and Flip good. Flip it, A. Complete the double play. That's some trash. That's not the guy you're going to see doubled up very Wait. often. So that was a Fair quick turn at second base. Good transfer and a strong throw. Thought I had him, too, with the hit going right back at the pitcher like that. So digging in now, Whit Merrifield. No one on base for him after the double play. Yeah, Matt, that two ball really changed the complexion of this inning. It looked like the middle of the order was going to have a chance to get a big hit with some ducks on the pond, but now they just have to try and get a two out rally started. All right, we'll guess. Four seam fastball. First pitch of the at bat. 
Now a swing and a bouncing ball. Gosh. And a close play at first. They, they, they dropped the everything on the infield. Nothing doing for the Royals. We'll head to the fourth, still scoreless. In the top of the fourth. Leading off the this game is rolling right along as we move into the middle innings with no Yellow. score. You'd think by now one of these two teams would be able to get some base runners on and get them in, but that hasn't been the case. Slider. And he's running out of. Here comes the first pitch. Fouled off. Gallo. I was lucky because I missed hit the button. Hitter, but throws right <laughs> it was selected in the first sooner round than I'd been planning. The first year All right, let's go with the changeup. Yeah, Maddie, they certainly got it right when they drafted this guy. He has turned himself into an absolute superstar. Everybody knows this guy's name, and kids are buying his jerseys. And it's fouled away. And every single one of these batters is becoming a battle. It's not where I want to be. Here's the 0 and 2. This is hit the other way out toward left field. Going after it is Gordon. Oh, come on. Get to it, and this should put a man in scoring position to start the inning. Around second now and headed for third. And he will make it there safely as he fires off the fourth with a leadoff triple. Yeah, Real after bad. that one, it looks third like base. the first run of the game could That's be brutal. coming pretty soon. Tomorrow. He got a pitch that he liked, and he roped it to the outfield. Then he showed the speed necessary to make None it. None of my outfielders are making third. plays. No. I meant to do the slider. How do you... I forget, there's a way to... And now a bluff here is he'll just make sure nothing's cooking over there at third. Okay, right. That gives me the ability to change the pitch up. Here now is his Drupal Cabrera. And a ball one and oh. What? Wow, I think the heart of this system that was well is right inside the on top of us because it is really coming down out there. This isn't an easy sport to play in the rain. It's clearly in stride inside the strike zone. Come on up. Totally robbed me on that one. And he won't bite at that one either. It's two and oh. All right, we'll go with the curveball. Two and zero. Here it is. Outside. Three and zero now. Come on, Duffy. He's got himself into a little bit of trouble out here. Middle of the order up in a run scoring situation. That's my and fault. I've been trying to, to challenge him. Going to have to make some good pitches. I haven't here. given him uh, any easy pitches to throw. On, now the three and zero offering is great. There off, we go. In there for strike one. This is a situation where the offensive player just needs to do his job. Take inventory, infield back, get you a ground Curve ball, ball somewhere in the infield, preferably off the corners, and get your team to lead. Here comes the 3-1 pitch. And he's able to lead ah. there for ball four. And that'll put runners at the put corners you, now. Put the guidance in on that too out. early. Now batting. Designated hitter, Shinsu Chu. Shinsu Runners Chu at the, the corners. Now reach base via the walk in no out plate appearance. Let's go with a change up here instead. From the belt, the pitch. And they'll try and get him out in front to start the end. Man. But this misses off the plate away. It's ball one. All right, let's see what the catcher calls for. 
It's a four seam fastball. Here it comes, one and oh. Yanked hard, but foul to the right. Four seam fastball, low and outside. Here's the one one now to chew. And that fastball's taken, but catches the outer third. With two strikes now and a runner at first, do you go for the strikeout? Or are you still looking for the double play? You do ball? whatever your well, catcher calls for. It depends on the type of pitcher that you are. Because you've been you're a power pitcher, you can go it up, making your own choices. Zone, but if you're a guy that induces a lot of ground balls with a sinker, I think Fast you have to stick with outside. that. Play. And that misses two and two. I wonder if that call not going his way right there has anything to do with walking the last guy. We all know umpires don't give you much on the corners if you're not throwing strikes consistently. And is there a way to... Uh... <laughs> is there a way to come out and have a conversation with the ump? Two two. Still even at two and two. No runs, three What's hits. The change up and low and outside the for the Rangers so far. Now this is hit not all that hard out to second. Merrifield picks it up and he's ah! digging in for when he screwed up the throw. Ah. One for one after a single this first time up. Yeah, and they take another single right here. That third base coach is dying to wave his arms. I wouldn't be surprised if anything hit hard through the infield. He's going to wave them. The fastball here is he'll take a look at oh. one, one and oh. Odor bats left but throws right and stands at 5 11. This is his sixth season for him in the big leagues. The catcher's just called for nothing but fastballs now. This is skied into short left center. Mondesi is calling for it. One down. Boy, he showed some. Oh, uh, the one runner came home. Great. Deep into the outfield uh -oh. to bring that one down. He thought the Great. outfielder might call him off, but he clearly had it under control. Into the box now, Ronald Guzman swung on and go 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 go. It's a chance, and this ah. one all the way to the wall. Got nothing. And the score is the runner from first. It's a three nothing game. That this was a double. Was a double or more. The Great. second it left his bat, he really drove it well, yes. and it ended up one hopping the wall out there. And more importantly, he picks up two RBI along the way. I didn't even see where he called for it, though. Here's the catcher, Jet Bandy. He grounds it sharply to third. My and he tries goodness, to what? To third, but he gets by the glove down the line. And the runner from second will stay put at third, so their runners at the corners now with one away. They've gotten their hits in deep counts. They've gotten their hits in early counts. This has been a real onslaught. Yeah, you can look at it one of two ways, Maddie. Either they have a ton of respect for the man on the mound, and they are just going to ambush tactics, and it seems to work for them. Or you can look at it the other way. They're just getting lucky. And here's the second-generation big leaguer, Delino DeShields. Base hit, and that'll get a run in. Hey, d I think we got a case right now. This team, they're just four runs. This in it. He's given up some runs, and it looks like he's starting to get a little bit tired, leaving some of these pitches up in the zone. Yeah, and I think there's a fight at the bat rack right now. Guys are licking their chops, knowing he's a little bit tired, going to leave stuff over the middle of the plate. Won't be surprised to see the bullpen get going. Oh, boy. Here's the right fielder, Hunter Pence, as he will take strike one on the fastball here. No balls and a strike. Now one you call that a strike. Ball game thus far. Now the 0-1. Bring back 
well below the knees laid off on the change up there. You can really tell Come on, how catch. effective this guy's going to be when guys are swinging at that changeup. So far in this one, they've been real smart to let it go. Four runs here in this half inning. Grounded up the first baseline, but this will get foul. It's a ball and two strikes. Using fastball. Pretty well struck high and deep to left field. Gordon going back. On the Did he get it? Track. He makes the catch. Okay. The first good thing that's happened all night. Two men on, two away here in the fourth group. Good decision to go get that one instead of letting it dribble back off of the wall. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. And he gets ahead here with the Getting his confidence back. When you dive into the numbers in this start, it's hard to believe that Curve this ball. guy is pitching as poorly as he has. Over 70% of his first pitches have been for strikes, but a lot of those have been right down the middle, right into the hitting zone. Curve ball bounces, and this one gets away. So now two men in scoring position. Well, you live by the sword. <laughs> catcher's looking like, bruh. He went with an off-speed pitch down in the zone, and that's the risk you take there. The catcher can't come up with it, and two runners advance. Come on, man. Just now put this guy down. Let's get out of the inning position. at 4-0. Go with the slider instead. I don't like anything my catcher's calling. And that misses two and one. Why is the pitch so wild and up like that? There, but you don't want your defender standing flat footed for much longer. Third to Shields on a second with go with the curveball instead. Clayton loves baseball. Thanks so much for the follow, Clayton. I'm glad you love baseball. I'm not loving it so much right now. Getting my cheeks clapped. Thanks so very much for the follow, and thanks for swinging through the live stream. I appreciate you. All right, let's try and put this a uh, little low and inside. Here's a pop up now. Please get that. Thank Duda you. Is there, and he puts it away to stop the bleeding. Nine men come to the plate, four score. Fielders One finally getting something bottom, done at the end of the four. inning. It's the Jeez. Rangers four and the Royals nothing. And now it'll be the cleanup spot for the Royals. Salvador Perez, he singled his last time up. I get to do Why some sticky bats. Left in this one is we're still early on, but you don't want to fall too far behind. They're already down by a bundle. All right, so we're going to look for this low and inside. Get on see if he puts the it there. For the big boys to start driving in some runs. Nope. Now a big fastball, and he's well Went up high with, with the swing. You might see a change of game plan right here from the pitcher and catcher. They have to find a way to get these guys off that early count meter. Look for a little bit of change of pace. Frizz myself out on that one. Looking for it high, and he went back low. Ready. Here's the 0-2 pitch. Still no Hold off. Two strikes. Another 0-2 coming. Ground oh. short. There is Grounded, though. Number one. The story of my batting all night. Grounders to the infield. So one away now for Alex Gordon. Gordon. All right, let's guess four seam fastball on this one. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Driven to deep right field. Looking up is the Shields. Oh. Get some bats going. <laughs> so a solo shot that time for Alex Gordon. Still behind by three runs, but at least it's something. Ugh, after a uh, long, rough night on the diamond, get a little something, something. 
This is just one of those parks where the ball seems to jump off the bat a lot more during the day. This is the first one of the day, but we might see a few more before this one's over. Oh, that was over the fence. I thought that would have bounced. Uh, let's look for the curveball. And that'll bring up Jorge Bonifacio. Oh, got the ankle! Go, go, go! Thankfully, he's able to Whip. recover, and he gets the second out at first. Ah. Had high hopes for that one. are empty here with two gone, and that'll bring up Hunter Dozier. Let's look for this one up high. Now here it comes. There's a shot out. To uh, got it to drop. Nice, Hunter. And this one scoots all the way to the wall. And they're going to hold him to a single here as they do a nice job of getting it back in quickly. A little blooper yeah, looper. Pull it off the wall. The outfielder does a really good job of getting that one in quickly, but I think they had a play there at second base. Yeah, I'm not sure what's going on there, Dan. I I, I gotta believe you're busting it out of the Let's box. You're looking for the sweat for the fastball. Somebody tells you no. I know it would have been a close play, but I think you gotta. Oh! The side right there. Drop, drop, drop. Into the box. Gala. Ryan O'Hearn to Shields. We'll get there, and he puts it away to one retire run. the side. One for the Royals here, and it comes courtesy of this Alex Gordon. Swing. Gordo! Four through four. It's now a 4 1 game. Digging in and looking for more. Joey Gallo. Flipping and Gallo. Sure the starter on the mound would like to hit the rewind button on that last inning. Oh, no doubt about that, Mac. That was a really rocky frame, but clearly not enough to chase him from this game. We'll see if he's still shaking a bit or if he's able to put this behind him. Energy is low. This is the top of the fifth. Yeah. Let's go ahead and start warming somebody up. No, no, no. Not subs. Bullpen. Go ahead and warm up Hill. Come on now. Start him off with a two seam fastball. Give it to him, Royals. Low and outside. Here comes the first pitch. There's the fastball that gets the lower part oh, this, of the zone um, called for a strike. Not consistent. Let's go with the curveball. He has called that same pitch a ball. There's a ah. ball that couldn't quite catch the inside. Cannot get that curveball like to stop to hanging outside. Curveball there, but it seemed like it popped out of his hand a little early, causing it to miss inside. Yep, I agree. Let's go with the two-seam fastball. All right, put it a little inside here. Oh! Got him to chase it. <laughs> now, let's stick with the two-seam. Go a bit high. The one-two. Pops this one up. Dozier trying to get there, but it's the nice. shortstop that gets there, and that's the first out of the inning. We'll take it. it. Digging first in base. once again as Dribble Cabrera. Cabrera. And we will go with a two-seam fastball. Let's try and put this one up high and outside where he's cold. First offering on its way. A ball and no strikes. Ugh. Let's go with the change up. We haven't sent that one down range here in a bit. Keep trying to work the high box. Hot shot down. Ah. 
chance for the backhand reach at third, but it gets oh my gosh. down the line. And he'll pull into second with one away. You guys on this left hand yeah, side of the field. On the fastball, so now, he got the change up. He was way out in front of it. Like the freaking Keystone cops over there. To keep it fair down the line. That's not always easy to do. Two seam. Hey, TJ, how you doing, man? Thanks so much for swinging through the live stream. Hope you've been having a good weekend. Stepping in now, Shin Su Chu. There we go. The first pitch to him is in there for a called strike one. He reached on a fielder's choice previously. Yep, we will go with the four seam fastball. But I am doing good, TJ. Thanks for asking, man. Ready with the nothing in one pitch. Oh, oh man, got him to looper. All right, we'll go with the fastball again. A little low and inside. Count remains at 0 2. Fought that one off. Cabrera, the runner at second with one away. Go with the change up this time. See if that takes him off his mark. Another 0 2 home. Swing and a man. That strikeout was now, all about setting the hitter. Took him apart. Yeah. You can see the first three oh, pitches cool. are coming in fast, and then he slows it down on the fourth pitch, knowing the hitter is sort of conditioned for the hard <laughs> Yet another way to upset a hitter's timing. Nice, nice barrage of pitches there, Duff. All right, we'll go two seam fastball. Try and put this one low, but keep it out of the dirt. Standing in now, Rukna Dodor, as he looks at a fastball nice. that's in there for strike one. He's working on a one-two game so far. Of course, now he's going to start so pitching, <laughs> getting back to the way he started off as I got a guy warming up. Go with the slider. Nothing in one count. Here it comes. Ugh. There's a shin high slider laid off for a ball. No. Nope. Come back at him with the fastball this time. One and two now as that one's fouled off. All right, let's go with the two seam. Try and go low and inside. Ah! Two and two now. Four runs, seven hits, and no errors in the contest for the Rangers so far. Nope. We're going with the two seat fastball again. I cannot get a handle on this pitcher. He's got such a long wind up that by the time he releases, I just don't have that much time to put any guidance on it between the leave and the plate. Set to deal on two and two. He stays alive, still two and two. Let's go with the slider. Try and put this one inside. Uh. Another 2-2 two -two offering. And another foul ball. Two seam fastball. And put it outside. Duffy sets. Here it is on two and two. Fouled away. Can't afford to fight with this guy all day on the mound. Let's go four seam fastball. Go inside this time. Well, this will be pulled okay. out there at second. All right, there we go. That'll be that. Rangers leave one Woo. as they hold on to a four to one lead.
Welcome back for the bottom of the fifth. Here's Heidi Watney. Well, Matt, Royals manager Ned Yost talked with me between innings about his lineup's offensive production, and he was very pleased with how little they're swinging and missing right now. He said he's really proud of the fact that they've only gone down on strikes once in the game, all while averaging over a base hit per inning. If that kind of combination continues, he thinks there's a lot more to look forward to. Thank you, Heidi. At least he's optimistic. <laughs> Four and one, bottom of the fifth. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Ah. Sends that one out of play for strike one. No, no, no. Let's look, uh, let's look for the fastball. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 and 1. Look. Oh. And that'll give him a close shave. Duda stands at six foot four inches tall, bats left, throws right. He was selected in the seventh round back in the draft of 2007. I know this guy wouldn't go into the category of superstar, uh, but to grind out the career he has being drafted where he was, uh, hats off to him. And he'll step on first for the out, three Good unassisted. Adalberto. Ready for another shot Mondesi. now. Adalberto Mondesi. Two base hits, both singles to it's this It's even point. more frustrating. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. That they're actually not right hitting that bad field. today. Chasing after it is DeShield. Ah, but, but we're just not. We're getting no breaks. the outfield grass. Well, these days don't happen often. You better dig yourself when you get three knocks in a big league way go. It's hard to have three hits in one day, but boy, this guy is off to a great start in this. Let's look, uh, look inside. In now, Billy Hill. And a pitch out. Nothing doing, though, and that's ball one. Weird. Why is he pitching? The guy's 0 for 2 today. Why are you pitching him out? Hits are even at seven apiece. A swing and a shot nope. down the corner. And that's going to wind up hooking just a bit foul. So a missed opportunity there. The 1-1 one, one home. And they pitch out here, but nothing's what happening. What is he Ball doing? Two. Don't understand the strategy here. Look for this one to come in low. This one's uh, out to field. Shields coming on. He can't get to it. This one's down. Well, D roll there's another base hit making it first and no second. They're piling 15. up the hits on the second day, but baseman. so far, not many Wait. runs to show for it. Yeah, definitely Better a few knocks in the cupboard makes you feel good, and the batting average goes up, but that doesn't help you win ball games. Somebody's got to come All right, we're going to be looking nice for the two-seam fastball here. Into the box now, Whit Merrifield. Can't find the zone there Ooh. as he lays off the break. Fortunately, I got caught the ball. <laughs> that was definitely so inside far. the strike zone. <laughs> Chance with that one. All right, let's look for this one to come in high and outside. Scared of the steal. This is uh, oh, how does he get to that? On the first, it's a double play, and another crisis is averted here as the inning is over. So it's no runs on two base hits, no errors, and one man left on. We're through five here at the ballpark. Texas is out in front, four to one. Game's cheating. Stepping in and ready for another <laughs> shot. Ronald <laughs> Guzman. One for two. Uh, line thus far. All right. All I really want to do is get my uh, relief pitcher started here. Top of the sixth inning. Let's go ahead and bring them. Uh, hold on. This is, uh, ooh, yeah, his energy level is almost zeroed out. Put Hill in. He is out from the bullpen now, here as he'll be making oil. his fifth appearance this spring Number training. 54. Yeah. Hill. Man, yeah, warm up mess. Come on. Yep, agreed. Four seam fastball. Go 
first offering on its way. They'll try and the heck kind of pitcher is that? It's ball one. Yes, we will go with the slider. He's ready. Here's the 1 0. Ball, ball two now. What the heck? Let's go with the slider. Now the 2 0 home. Finds the zone. There we go. One. Good pitch right there from the reliever. Tough for hitters to do much with pitches in that location unless they're looking for it. See, like a fast pitch, fast pitch softball pitcher. Let's go with the uh, fastball. Good, put it right down the middle. Now the two-one pitch is strike two, Woo. swinging. All right, we'll go with two-seam fastball. Try and tuck this one a bit inside. The two-two. Now a flare out to go the center. In there, a base hit. Great. The catcher, number 28, Jet <laughs> Bandy. Settling in now. <sighs> Bandy, Great. He's one for two in this one. Go two seam fastball. Try to put it up high. First pitch coming. Here it is. Yeah. Got him. Ball taken, but that gets the zone for a strike. Guzman aboard here at first. Two seam fastball out. again. Go ahead and put it straight down the middle. Respect it. Four seam fastball this time. Low and inside. Swing and a miss as he ran the fastball. Sit down for the first down. The center. If you've got a good fastball going and they're not handling, such a weird throwing it right there. Three fastballs in a row. He gone. <laughs> Usually the announcers are pretty cornball-y, but I'll give them that one. All right, we'll go with a two-seam fastball. Put it high and inside. He's a little, he's a little warm up there. A little lower. Stepping in now, Delino De Shields. Oof. As he'll look at a fastball in there on the outer half. It's 0-1. Like, I can't imagine how any batter three, like, gets a read on where this ball is going at all with the way this dude is throwing. Do a four seam fastball. He's ready. Here's the 0 1. Hey. Fastball hey. down around the knees there, taken for a strike. And now we'll go with the two seam. It's really tough. The red is so subdued here. It's really tough for me to read if he's hot in these zones. Go low and outside. We get him to chase this one. Yep, uh, but he fought it off. All right, slider is going to eat him up. And yep, tied him up in a knot. That's back-to-back -back strikeouts now as they've been unable to advance that leadoff single into scoring position. Yeah, clearly no problem. Quit talking to yourself. Right now, Matt. He's Go grab some pine. This inning after giving up that hit. Now we'll see if he can finish it off strong as well. Hunter Pence. My arch nemesis. He's talking trash. He ain't even up in the mound yet. Let's see, uh, let's give him, yep, let's give him the four seam. They've only got one out left. This inning, let's go high, up and around the numbers. He's set and the pitch. 
92 splits the plate and it's strike one. Both teams with eight. Come back at him with the fastball again. We go low and outside this time. And this has fallen into an 0 2 hole here. <laughs> Got the catcher pointing no at you. With two strikes, and some guys never want to get there. Let's see the approach right go here. Go with the four-seam like fastball again. A bit. Maybe choke up and try and work the ball back up the middle the other way. Nope. We're going low and outside again. Here's the 0 and 2. Ah! Catch the zone there. Ball one. 0 2 pitch, not even close to the zone, and a fastball might be an indication that he's going to start using some of his secondary pitches. You're right. So I'm going to give him the slider. The 1 2. Neither guy willing to give in, <laughs> and the ad battle continue. It's a battle. Sixth inning. 4 to 1 is our score. Come on, man. Two-seam fastball. The next one-two pitch. Bounce to first. Oh, and come on. With it. And a good <laughs> effort as he's able to stick with it <laughs> and get the third out of the inning. I stink it. Fielders are just. But they lead it four to one. Guys are a bunch of. Clowns. Mike Miner enters. All right, we got out of it. Go. In the bottom of the six. Now pitching for the Rangers, number twenty-three, Mike Miner. At the plate, Salvador Perez. One for two. We have been getting people on base, but failing to seal the deal. They just haven't had consistently good at bats. That's true, too. I never do. First pitch on its way. Ah. This ball was too much for him there. Swung right through it. Try and guess the pitch on this one. Uh, let's look for the knuckle. The 0 and 1 delivery. Oh! The gap in right center. This is going to be a base hit. Blue and he may take that big turn at first. And this will bang up against the wall. And now this is thrown wildly, just getting it into the infield. Well, now you see how difficult it is to be a catcher. This ball is really smoke. Gets all the way to the wall, Nero. But he just doesn't have the foot speed to turn this into an extra base hit. Yeah, his calling card is definitely not his ability to run the bases. It's for <laughs> offense and massaging and pitching staff. Hey, they just call me slow. All right, let's guess. Look for the change up into the box. Alex Gordon is he'll get caught. Ah, that's the one there at strike one. Two hits in two trips for him thus far. All right, let's look for the fast ball this time. And a good looking uh, from Gordon, slider. but he can't come up with it, and it's 0 and 2 now. And now the Ranger bullpen swings into action. A lefty and a right hander are throwing down there. Great. All right, let's look uh, for the slider. Looking to put him away. Here's the 0 2. Swung it was. And missed. Really fooled him that time for the first out. That's not an event he's going to look back on and be happy about. Obviously, the strikeout result isn't good, but to go down on three pitches and none of which were even in the strike zone, as you see there. I know. That's I know. Bad at batting. Let it go. Just look for a little contact hit here. In now, Jorge Bonifacio. He swings and hits it foul off to the right. Fastball got behind it. He's hitless in his two at bats so far. He homered last game, man. Why is he not getting anything going?
Possibly a double uh. ball now for Andrews. One there on the first. It's a double play as their woes continue. The inning is over. Royals bats are quiet there. They trail it four to one. Nothing. Can Welcome I get an back error? To Coors Field here in Denver. The Rangers on break. top in this one as we get a look at our game summary through the first six innings of play. Killing me. Isaiah Kiner Falefa is up off the bench as he'll pinch hit here to start number inning number seven. Isaiah Kiner Falefa. All right, let's go with the change up. Pretty much the whole box to play with here. Swing and a blooper to the right side. And that'll get what? down for a base hit. No. So it's an inning opening single to kick off their half of the seventh. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. As we take a look at the replay now here, you can see that it was a angle changeup. Nice job of staying Gallo. back on it, and he's able to tattoo it for a double. And you know, if that pitch would have supplied more velocity, it might have been out of Your here. He plate. hit it right on the screws. Hitting for the Logan Rangers. Forsythe will Number come 41. off the bench now as he'll pinch Logan. hit with the runner at second Forsyth. and nobody out. The nightmare continues. Thought I was getting a handle on it too. Change up to uh. low and it's one and oh. Go with the four seam fastball. Now the one oh hey. is taken strike one. Force nice. a six foot one inch right handed swinger and thrower. He's a nine year major league vet. Slider. Tight inside. Into the corner and slicing foul. A great swing right there. I know the ball. Forcing foul, fastball. He absolutely laced that pitch right there. He's just got to stay back a little bit longer. The one two. Lifted in the air to right field. Let's get that. And that's taken Singer. straight away what? right. Will he try? Did he tag second? up? And he'll make it up to third safely uh, here with one away. Chase Darno will grab a bat and pinch hit now, and he'll be looking for at least a fly ball. Nobody has tagged up on a fly ball all night. Darno. In two and a half hours, nobody's tagged up on a fly ball. All right, we'll go with the change up again. Starts him out with a change up for a strike. Doesn't like that. Two seam fastball. Put this one outside too. Ready with the nothing in one pitch. Hit hard to the right. Foul. Two seam fastball again. Working for the punch out and the offering. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. Hey, I don't mind you throwing a fastball in this situation, but I think I'm going to give him a change with ourselves. That one caught a little bit too much of the plate. Off speed pitch, and there is strike three. Oh, and boy, that zone just got a bit larger. Kind of gave me a little in the pitcher's so favor, but yeah, outrageous. <laughs> hey, listen, you kind of gave me the strike on that one. <laughs> <laughs> Even the best are going to miss some from time to time. Yeah, he should be complaining sort of about that. Like that last one. Not sure the yes, hitter would want to hear that, though. He's got a legit complaint for that one. <laughs> it's like, that surprised me. It's clearly outside the damn strike zone. <laughs> uh, I'm just making mistakes. I like it. First pitch fastball in there for a called strike. Runner in scoring position with two gone. <laughs> Man. All right. Two seam fastball. No jokes. No jokes. Let's take it seriously. Oh! That time it's 0 2. Way ahead. 
on third with two out. Might have thought that was the four seam fastball coming in a bit quicker. Give him the two seam again. On its way, the 0 2 pitch. A little tardy on that swing as it's well wide at first. Now we'll give him the change up. The 0 2 once more. Now a line. Uh, you're going to pay for that. For the base hit. And they'll add one more to the lead. It's now a 5 to 1 ball game. <sighs> Hey, that's what you try and do as an offense. You get a four-run lead. They're a oh, grand the slam lead. ahead, Dan. But you're the a former base. closer warming up. When you see a three-run oh, lead and then your offense gets it to four. I was you know sure throwing in the changeup was the right thing to do. He just Don't ate that, that one alive oh, right in the green zone. Frippin' lucky that wasn't a damn homer. You sit and watch eight innings of baseball. You get up to warm up in the ninth, and you're all ready to go thinking, hey, I'm going to come in and get me a three-out save, and all of a sudden you're out of the game because it's a four-run lead. Of course you think about it as a reliever. Standing in now, Rukna Dodor, as he takes a cold strike at the knee. Sure I was going to be able to hold these guys to four. To four. Ready with the 0-1. Rip down the line. God, freaking third baseman is third, but again, ah! Davidson rounds third and is digging for the plate. He scores, and it's now a six to one ball game. And that just pains a the pitcher. They're already given up a run in the inning, and he has now two outs, almost out of trouble, base. but then serves Ronald. up a mistake. The runner busts it around the bases to score from first, and the hitter is in scoring position on second. That was my fault on the field. That was my fault on the outfield, but the third baseman should have gotten that. Slide. Ah, oh, no. I didn't mean to throw that one. It's fine. Stepping in now, Ronald Guzman. As the first pitch misses to him, it's ball one. So far, He's giving me enough strikes. I can't even be one. mad at him for calling that one a ball. Slider. That's what I meant to pitch last time. The 1 0 is laid off for ball two. This inning really feels like it's getting away from him out there. As a reliever, you can't let that happen. Nothing you can do about what's already happened. Come on, man. You just got to get one more out. If you're not focusing on the guy in the batter's box. Runner in scoring position at second. Take the slider down. home. Lofted in the air out toward right center. After it is Hamilton. He gets there to Outfield make the catch is just not and that ends the inning. Fielders so just not helping him at all. Three hits, no errors, and a runner left on. Stretch time coming up here in Denver. It's the Rangers six. No, 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 no worries, uh, TJ. Glad you're having a good weekend. Hope you're getting some uh, downtime. We'll stay in the ball game as a new shortstop. Now playing shortstop. Number nine. Logan Forsythe will stay in the ball game now and take over in left field. What, are you, uh, what have you been playing recently, man? Logan. Chase Darno. It's going to go. I think for a while you had a, a little bit of a siege run going on, so you still with that? Jeffrey Springs gets the call from the pen to take over on the mound and start the whole just bringing their subs in. Plate. Hunter Dozier, one for two on his line so far in the game. It doesn't look very promising so far in this one as we move into the later innings. Down by a bundle, it's time to get some base runners and hopefully a long ball to get them back into this one. And he fouls this one off. Nothing. The wind up and look high and outside. Change up gets him out in front for strike two. Great off-speed pitch right there. He was definitely sitting fastball, wanted to turn and Look burn. for the fastball Everything now. went flying. This pitcher might be on the attack with that pitch all game long. High in the air down the right field line. But this is going to wind up a foul ball. Let's look for a contact hit this time. And here's a ball in the air now, carrying a bit out toward right center. 
And this will be by Pence for the first out. TJ says, I've been missing my wife a lot. I've been playing a lot of C's, literally all I play now. <laughs> it's been an 0 for 2 effort for him to this point. First delivery to him on the way. High fly ball out to straightaway center. The Shields will wait on it. And there's the second out of the inning. Here's Lucas Duda now. Just a he lesson was in pain. Ball last time up. That's good to hear, man. I'm glad you got a got your teeth into something that you really here enjoy. Ah! After the first offering here, I, 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 I can well tell when I was coming around on it that was not the thing to swing on. Swing and what? And he's in the hole. O two now. And that ah. one runs in on him as he can't get his arms extended. A great pitch there, and the inning is over. Royals go down one, two, three. They trail six to one. Start of the eighth on its way, but first, Heidi Watney standing by with this report. Matt, I talked with the Rangers manager during the inning break. So, have you found a uh, regular like squad to play with, TJ, or are you just playing with randos? Very pleased with the quality of their at bats. Looking at the numbers, me and the wife talk a lot, and I just want to be with her in person. Where they were behind in the count. Yep. Yeah, that I completely understand that. These guys are absolutely battling at the plate and making it very difficult for the opposition to get them out. Good stuff, Heidi. Thanks. Now, are you joining up and going to basic uh, pretty soon yourself? He'll lead things off as they look to perhaps build on an already sizable lead. All right. Two seam fastball. First pitch of the at bat. Popped him up. Twenty four pitcher, thanks so much for the follow. I appreciate you. Thanks so much for coming through the live stream. Ran uh so TJ says playing with randoms and squads sometimes. I'm joining the Air Force going as an officer. Okay, very cool. Not a bad gig. Steady paycheck. I don't even know what pitch I just hit. Change up a little bit inside, one and oh. How do you wind up throwing the change up outside the box? All right, we'll go back at that one again. Yeah, thanks for the uh, follow, 24 picture, but um, not uh, even if you're a brother, man, I'm not cool with that word in my uh, chat. So if you can refrain from that, I'd appreciate it. Let's see. Um, Who pulled the string and had him way out to chase it. Ball and a strike. Put the slider. Try to put a little inside. Now this pitch is swung on and popped up. And this will also head toward the right side of the infield. No more Mazzara will get to call the pinch hit here as we'll see what he can do with two out and the base is empty. No more Mazzara.
Okay, so let's see, we got somebody stupid in the chat. Sorry guys, let me uh, just get the report in on this uh, idiot. Sorry for the interruption there. Uh, let's see. In there at the knees, strike one. And look, I don't put a lot of rules and, like, explain a lot of things to people what the expectations are in my chat, because I kind of feel like in the 21st century, it shouldn't be necessary. But the, the deal of it is, is simply this, is I'm a working professional. I have a lot of friends and peers who have kids. Lots of people come by and view my VODs. Lots of my co-hosts and friends and co-workers, their kids come by and watch my VODs. So, I just, this is, uh... You know, the game content is whatever the game content is, but in general, this is a family-friendly channel, so I just don't uh, have any time for stuff like that. There's plenty of, plenty of other channels on Twitch to go do stuff like that. Here's one what the heck was that? High, it's one and one. Come on, dude, just set this dude down. Slider. Trying to get high and right. Ground ball, right side. Oh, are Field you? Scoops it up. Pro goes to third. And he'll reach I've done that multiple times, and I'm a little bit distracted by. Having to block, ban, and report that and dude. Former pitcher, I can tell you, nothing is more painful than having to get extra outs in an inning. That should have been out number three there. Instead. I know, I know, I know. That was my fault. And get back to work. All right. Here's a slider to start what? things out. Looked at for ball one. Come on, up. That was so clearly in the strike zone. Ready with the 1-0. Lays off a fastball that doesn't miss by much, and it's 2-0. Slider. Two L count. The pitch is taken high. There we go. Still a strike.
go back at it with the slider again. This one up high. Three balls and a strike to Willie Calhoun. Well, this has been a long inning already, and I know he doesn't want it to get any longer. I expect a challenge pitch right here. Going with the slider again. Hard ground ball to third. And the throw forces him to lay out for that one, but he keeps a foot on the bag and afford the out. <laughs> Rangers lead one. They hold on to their 6-1 to one lead. <laughs> hey, TJ. Thanks for, the, uh, <clears throat> thanks for the encouragement, man. I appreciate it. <laughs> Yomar Mazzara will stick around this as he'll take over in right field. Now playing right field. Number 30. No Jesse Chavez is on to pitch out of now the bullpen in the bottom Texas. half of the eighth. Number 53. Jesse Chavez. Nolan Fontana is Number also 15. into the game as he takes Nolan. over at short. Fontana. Danny Santana will also come in now as he takes over out in center. Adalberto Mondesi will be the first one. Oh, I'm up to bat. Wasn't even paying attention. Turn and hit from the left side now. Adalberto. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, let's look for the uh, change up. First delivery to him on the way. Ah. And a miss at a it was the change. Had him all kinds of goofed up at the plate. <laughs> I can't speak from experience, but that's got to feel good right there. Throwing a nasty change up Forcing first fastball pitch and the swing and a miss on it. Now he pretty much opened up any pitch in his arsenal. Ball grounded toward Odor. Ah, man. And a good throw gets him one gun. Into the box, Billy six. Hamilton. He steps Billy. in off a base hit in his last half. Billy's going to try and guess the pitch, too. Try and guess the slider. First offering on its way. Right side. Oh! oh. Cleanly. And the throw will be too late as he yes, beats him out. Time. Well, when you're winning a game this late, the last thing you want to do is give the other team some man. open. That's what this air does. They have a base runner and a chance to make some noise now. Stepping into the I don't know that we have that much Merrifield. No <laughs> hits in three tries so far. Whip. He struck out once. Here comes the first pitch. A ground ball to third and they finish two. Odor. That's like these guys have got like four double plays on me this game. Afternoon and the inning is over. Around the horn they go. Five to four to three to end the threat. More ahead from Denver right after this. Jose Trevino will try to get his club a little ninth inning insurance as he'll grab a bat to pinch hit, leading things off here. All right, guys, I apologize. I got to step away and use the restroom real quick, so I'm going to put you guys on the pause screen for a brief moment. I'll be back as quickly as possible. Thanks so much for everybody who has swung by and hung out tonight. If you don't, uh, if you don't hang out for the ninth inning, I completely uh, completely understand. Uh, if you do, like I said, I will be back as quickly as possible. By your castle wall, at the close of the day. I heard a man sing Though his head it was grey And as he was singing The tears then came There'll never be peace Till Jamie comes home the church is in ruins, the state is in yours. Delusions, oppressions, and murderous wars. We dare now we'll say it, but we can was to blame. There'll never be peace 
till Jamie comes home. My seven brass sons for Jamie drew sword, but no a great render green beds in the yard. It'll break the sweetheart of my faithful old day. There'll never be peace till Jamie comes home. The life is a burden that bows me down. Sin I tend my birds and he tend his crown. But until my last moments, the words are the same. There'll never be peace till my Jamie comes Hey, what's up, everybody? We back. So let's get back to it. Wrap this game up. Send him the change up. Miracles do happen. Ninth inning underway now as the first pitch is taken for a cold strike. All right, we'll go with the changeup this time. Pitch has not worked out very well for me at all this whole game. Across two pitches. Liner towards second, but an Adam Bull right to him for the first down. I thought that one took a, I thought that was, it was a one hopper. Stepping in, Chase Darno. He got called out on strikes his last time through. Yeah, pretty deflating at bat right there, Maddie. Not only for him, but the team the as well. Up again. He's got to find a way to pull a trigger. Can't get caught guessing with runners in scoring position. No. Too high. But we'll come back at him with the changeup. The 1-0. Doesn't catch the outside corner. It's a ball. A little suspect. Bases are empty. One man out. <laughs> Slider. And wow, that looked to be well inside, but it's a called strike. Two and one now. <laughs> All right. Change up one more time. A little high one. Now the two one takes a pass and misses that strike two. Chased it big time. Two seam fastball. Should eat him up alive. Here now the two two. Popped up. And the there we go. Made there. Two gone here in the ninth. So we will get the last at bat. Oh no, I got one more. I gotta sit down. Number two, Jeff Mathis. Change up. Up high. Swing and a hard hit ball towards the hole. And the off-balance throw gets him as he takes away a hit, and the side is retired. Think about it, gentlemen. You finally got some good fielding going on here in the last that inning. That is pure magic. More Cactus League action coming your way after <laughs> so this. Thoroughly not interested in that super athletic play that he was like, uh, Whatever, man. Jose Trevino will stay in the ball now game now and take field. over in left field. Number 71. Jose Please come on! Don't give me nine. Is on and he'll take me, over uh, sub out your whole freaking lineup for the last inning. Push. 
striding in to start okay, the just two nine. people. Salvador Perez, and the they'll boy. need him to get something the going Kendrick. here. You're going to guess two seam fastball. First delivery to him on the way. Hard hit toward the hole. Right through the gap. Base hit, so he goes after the first pitch he sees, and he's on to open up the inning. Next guy. Talk about having a pretty special game. That's his third the single of the game, D-Row. And yet, Three, four, four. we not score no game. runs. Yeah, just not trying to do too much, Dan. Taking what the pitcher's giving him right here. If the fastball's away, shooting it the other way. If he's got something hanging in the middle of the plate, turning and burning a little bit. Nice execution. Okay, we're going to guess he's going to put this one up high. And over the plate. Into the box now. Alex Gordon. Line drive to center field. Santana patrolling center makes the play one out. Ugh. Well, we've mentioned the Up conditions aren't ideal with the rain the coming field. down, and that Go can ahead. make every play a oh, little bit of an adventure. Go. You really have to concentrate, and he did there to haul it down. Ready now, Jorge Bonifacio. He was a double play victim last time around. Yeah, and another double play right here. All right, we're going to guess he's going to do game. this one high Let's and outside. the same way, hard in, soft away. First pitch of the at-bat. On oh, a less than impressive ah. swing there to start the at-bat. It's 0-1. Ugly swing right there. That pitch wasn't even close. Give me low. And he offered at it. I'm not sure right now if I'm the pitcher. You could probably throw anything you want up there in this guy. Shut up. At it. Takes this the other way to right. But Gosh, man. To move out there and right as he hauls this one in for the second out. Up next for the Royals. The third baseman, Hunter. He's getting nothing. Into the box now, Hunter Dozier. And he needs to make something happen. They're down to their final out here in the ninth. We're going to guess slider. He's set. Here it comes. And this one's hit on the ground. Yeah, batter's hitting over 300 that have been able to do nothing with this pitching staff. It's away the 0 1 pitch. And this is in the air to right. And this should do it. Mazar is under it, makes the catch, and that's the ball game. You might think it's just another it's a rough win. night of work, gentlemen. It's hard to win in this game, especially on the road, but they find a way to get it done, and they should be very happy with this Sturgeon. performance. Six to one, the final tally today. The Rangers took the lead in the fourth and held on until the end. Lance Lynn takes home the win. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Pleasak, <laughs> and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching using them emotes, the CJ. For more, make your way over to All right, for everybody who happened to swing by and join the live. I appreciate you, TJ. I especially appreciate you swinging through and hanging out, brother. Uh, I should be back on. Uh, my plan is to be back on Tuesday night. Again, everything's a little catch as catch can now with the new job. Um, so we will see how that goes. I'm planning on playing. I can't see my chart from over here. But I should be playing more MLB The Show 19. Uh, but I might dip over and check out uh, Hell Divers on PlayStation 4, which uh, has been. In my backlog for quite some time. time of the ball game. Two That's fine. My plan. My plan this week minutes. is a mix of playing MLB the show and checking that game out. So for joining us here not sure exactly what I have lined up for Tuesday, but uh, drive home safely. but like I said, I should be back on uh, Tuesday night and one other night this week. So if you have time, please do swing by and hang out. Keep those notifications on or follow me on Twitter so you catch the uh, announce whenever I'm going live. And uh, if you're interested, also go over and follow me on uh, YouTube on the Rounding Off Affinity channel. Those links are right down below on uh, my information page. You can just click the link there and follow through to my YouTube channel as well. As I will be live streaming from there as well from time to time. And uh, I always post VODs and Let's Plays uh, either for my live streams or from local recordings as well. Well, thanks so much for joining in. I do appreciate you. I am going to try and raid a friend of mine. So if those of you who have 
been hanging out or willing to hang out for a few moments more, I would appreciate it. I don't have uh, anybody who I'm networked with who is playing anything similar, but I will sw swing by and see James Autumn, who's playing Project Zomboid. So thanks so much for joining in. Until next time, happy hunting. Take care of yourselves. Stay safe out there. Play the games that you like and stream the games that you love. Once again, my name has been Agastically Stamus from the Rounding Off Infinity Gaming Channel on YouTube, as well as Game Logic on Twitch. For you YouTube viewers out there, I appreciate you as well. Please feel free to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Until next time, good night, good luck, and good gaming. For those of you who are going to stick around for the raid, please do. As a way, we go. Should all acquaintance be forgot and never brought to mind? Should all acquaintance be forgot and all lang syne? For all lang syne, my jewel, for all lang syne, we'll take a cup of kindness yet. For old lang syne And surely you'll be your pint stop And surely I'll be mine We'll take a cup of kindness yet For old lang syne We twa here run up at the breeze And put the gowans fine But we wander through Fit, sin old lang syne. We twa he peddled in the bun, frae morning sun till dine. But seas between us braid, he roared, sin old lang syne. And there's a hand, my trusty fear, and gies a hand o oh thine. We'll tack our right get willy walk for all lang syne. For all lang syne, my jewel, for all lang syne. We'll tack a cup of kindness yet for all lang syne.